What is up guys, Faded here and welcome back to the channel for another video and today I wanted to tell you guys how to stop Windows from automatically installing apps like Candy Crush and things of the like and no matter what you do you can right click and you know uninstall these apps or go into the apps and features and uninstall them but they just seem to come back a number of hours or a number of days later and they're using up your bandwidth and just automatically installing basically junkware into your computer. So the first thing that you want to do is go into the Microsoft Store and then now, you, depending on which update you are on, you might have to click on profile, but in my case, you just click the see more button or the three dot buttons and go into your settings. And then once you get into your settings, you're going to see update apps automatically. Now you would think that this would keep your apps automatically updated, which it does, but it also installs this junkware. So you want to go ahead and just turn that off. And you can also turn off live tile and videos automatically, which, you know, this, this just basic stuff that you would do, you know, because you know, why would you play videos automatically and, and there's no sense in having live tile stuff. Now you don't need to mess with anything else here, but once you've got all those settings the way you want, you want to go back into the downloads and updates section. And here you're going to see a list of, you know, recent activity and, and the like. Then you're going to click the Get Updates button. And what this is going to do is going to check your computer for all of the updates for the apps that you need on your computer. Now, as you can see here, you don't see anything for Candy Crush or things like that. All you see are the basic Windows apps here. Now, a lot of these are running through their updates and everything, so that's all you really have to do. But the problem is, is you have to manually do this um, every so often to make sure that your apps stay up to date. Um, but that's just kind of the cost that comes with not having to download Candy Crush every other day. So yeah, guys, that's basically it. This will take care of your, your Candy Crush problems where you're automatically getting this junkware. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any more questions, please put them down below and you guys have a good one.